Since the dawn of humanity, the understanding of well-being and rational decision-making has remained relatively unchanged. However, recent discoveries in neuroscience and psychology may fundamentally change long-held theories about emotions and reasoning. One recent study analyzed patients who had experienced damage to the amygdala, a primitive part of the brain that typically regulates emotions. What they discovered was that these patients had often lost their ability to feel emotions and make basic decisions. The implication of this discovery is that our decisions are not determined simply by logic or emotions alone, but rather a combination of the two. When we make a bad decision that affects our well-being, it is typically caused by an imbalance between our reasoning and our emotions. This process of understanding and facilitating emotions into rational thinking is known as emotional intelligence. Originally developed in 1990 by John Mayer, David Caruso, and Peter Salovey, the theory of emotional intelligence can be broken down into four simple aspects. One, the ability to perceive emotion. For humans, cues like facial expressions and gestures can indicate complex emotions that influence our understanding of other people, such as happiness, sadness, anger, and fear. Two, understanding emotions. Emotions convey information. For example, happiness usually indicates a desire to join with other people, sadness indicates a desire to avoid people, and so on. Each emotion conveys its own patterns of possible messages and actions associated with those messages. Three, using emotions to facilitate thought. In recent years, cognitive scientists have discovered that emotions prioritize our thinking. Therefore, having a good system of emotional input can help you focus on things that truly matter. Four, managing emotions. Managing emotions involves the ability to promote certain types of behavior through emotions and using them to your advantage. For example, if you're sad, you're more likely to be reflective and analytical. If you are happy, you're more likely to be social and outgoing. These four aspects that make up emotional intelligence inform our decisions, help predict life outcomes, and help us understand people in order to build healthy relationships.